Cool. Awesome. So he's going to go next. Hey, you. What is your, what is your name? Nice to meet you. My name is Paul. And you said your dad is gay. My daughter is gay. And so I want to share. Yes. And on and at Gay Pride, I shared this story. And it's a Thanksgiving story. I came out of the closet when my little girl was eight years old. It was really hard. All of us think that we have the hardest coming out of the closet story of anybody in the world. And we're all right. <laughs> we're all right. It was that hard coming out. So I came out of the closet when she was eight. It was very difficult. She came out of the closet when she was about 16. You open the damn door and you don't know who's coming out behind you. <laughs> she came out when she was about 16. Say it's not genetic. I'm not blaming it on her mother, got it? It's <laughs> Then, when she was about 20, I asked the young man to video this for me, asked Blake to video this for me, because I'm going to send it to Lara. She now works in uh, Orlando. I talked to her a little while ago. She's now 26. When she was about 20, she and I, when she was still in college, went down to the Gay Pride Parade in Phoenix, where we lived, and we walked with Pete Flagg. That's my story, that I walked with Pete Flagg. And I said, this is my gay daughter, and she loves me. And she said, that's my gay dad, and he loves me. Her name is Laura. Say hi, Laura. Hey, Laura! You rock! You rock, girl! And look who's hugging her. Look who's hugging Laura's dad. That's right. And that's it. So you come, you come out of the closet. This morning I was at Cathedral Church of Hope and the pastor, uh, Reverend Hudson, said this morning, she said, who do you think is out there telling the gay people Jesus loves them? <laughs> don't look over there. Don't look. Don't look. Don't look. Don't look. Don't look. <laughs> but by God, Jesus loves me. Sign home. And my daughter loves me and look who's hugging me for that. Thank you. Thank you.